Hey guys, this is Melanie, and if you are watching my husband Brant's channel, Cameraman Ron and Bama Beach Bum, you know that we are all in South Florida hanging out. And for our last night, I decided I'm gonna cook everybody dinner. We're gonna be making some Nashville hot chicken sliders. So let's get started and let's see what everybody thinks. Let's first get started with our breadcrumbs. You can use uh, breadcrumbs, crushed corn flakes, panko breadcrumbs, and you wanna mix your uh, crumbs with flour. So I got about a quarter cup of flour in here. I'm gonna season it up with some paprika. I will put the recipe down below, some salt, and some oregano. Get that mixed up. And then for our chicken, I have to show you guys this. Do we have any buttermilk fans? Well, drop me a comment if we have some buttermilk fans because I took this chicken and I took chicken cutlets that are, uh, I cut them the size of the sliders and I marinated them in buttermilk and hot sauce, okay? And I wanna season these up just a little bit. So I'm actually gonna pull them out and season them. Can you see how I cut them the same size as the sliders? I'm not using pepper or cayenne because the sauce has pepper. The sauce is spicy. Okay, you guys ready? We're gonna take our chicken and we're gonna dredge it in our, in our breadcrumbs or you can use cornflakes and flour and then you wanna set it on a greased baking sheet. So let's get going on these. We'll do a few at a time. And these are going to be baked chicken sliders. Check that out. Okay, we got our chicken cutlets coated. You can see how thin they are. Perfect for a baked Nashville hot chicken slider. One thing that my grandma always taught me, she would make these cornflake baked coated chicken tenders. And what she would do before she baked them, she would always take butter and she would put a piece of butter on each chicken, whether it was chicken tenders or baked chicken, you know that like old fashioned, like cornflakes coated chicken. 450 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes, just until they're nice golden and finished up. Okay guys, now we're gonna make the glaze. I'm gonna start by melting some butter. We've already got some going. And then we want to add our sweetener. I've got some honey. And our, you can use coconut palm sugar, you can use brown sugar, garlic powder, paprika, and the star, the cayenne. Let's let this melt and simmer and come together and then we're gonna coat the chicken in it. Okay guys, let's check them out. Ooh, nice, golden, brown. Look at that. Let's make sure we can get up under there. Perfect. We are gonna broil these just until they're nice and toasty. Any other butter believers out there? If you are all about the butter, give me a thumbs up, leave me some comments. I prefer to use the real stuff. How about you? Now, check this out. We've got our sauce that we made. And what we're gonna do is we're just gonna pour it right over the chicken. And you just wanna get them nice and covered. And now we're gonna make a little uh, salad. You can use coleslaw. This is just washed shredded lettuce. And I'm gonna use Tessa or Primal Kitchen ranch dressing and marinade. And what we're gonna do, this is gonna kinda cool it down a little bit. We got our toasted buns. So I set it up where everyone could just build their own, grab their bun grab their chicken, put it on their slider if they want lettuce with the ranch. And then Nashville chicken hot sliders, gotta have a dill pickle right on top. And of course I made my grandmother's recipe potato salad, which- Hey guys, let's dig in. Yeah. 
man. That was really good. How is it, Ronald? It's really good. Like, seriously. What did you bread this in? Cornflakes. Well, I mean, there you go. My grandma's sweet bread. Man, like, it was obvious you were cooking for us tonight if you're breading chicken and cornflakes. My grandma I mean, breaded cornflakes. That, that's what that, that is really, really flavorful. Makes it crispy. It, it is. It's definitely got a, got a punch to it. Yeah, but mm -hmm. it's got a sweet too. Yeah, I mean, it, it feels feels powerful. It's like sweet, savory, spicy, I mean, everything you want. <laughs> I'm mad. That is really good. Cornflake, I would have never thought of that. Mm -hmm. it's good. I'm not going to lie, honey. These are kind of addicting. They're so bad. They're beyond. Like, I, I might, I, like, I could legit, <laughs> if you don't eat all these, I might break into your house tonight and eat more. <laughs> so I'm just, don't be, don't be I actually on. think that that might happen. So we better lock the door. It's not above um, the realm of possibility. <laughs> How was that prank earlier, Ron? I don't uh, appreciate that very much. Uh -huh. So Melanie decided she was going to try to, to prank me like her husband. First off. I've never pranked you. First off, I need you to understand that, you know, now you have one coming. And the last time uh -oh. Grant had one mm -hmm. coming, somebody shot at him. Uh -oh. So I just wanted to make sure that you're aware of what you've, the well, realm see, you've stepped into. I might prank you before you actually prank I, and, me. I mean, and you might, but it, it will build up. I mean, just so you're aware. So, it, it, you know, that's. I'm just upset that you didn't get to see a manatee. That so was nice. disappointing. We looked. We tried so hard. Melanie really I wanted to see a manatee. I don't even trip. think you're allowed to look at them. I think that's how protected they are. They, like when they swim by, I think you're supposed to. You're look definitely away. not supposed to throw cabbage at them. No, you're definitely not supposed no, to throw no, cabbage. No cabbage. <laughs> we, had to, we had to talk the girls out of that yeah. one. So we didn't. We don't even have cabbage. We were doing some recon. We really wanted to. We really. I wonder if they would to. eat cheese balls. Ooh. That's a great. You know, you know. That's Everybody a great question, Ron. Melanie, we appreciate the dinner tonight. Absolutely. It was exceptional. Absolutely. So good. Thank you. And it goes so good with that potato salad. It's addicting to All right. So and good. I want to go right now and say, if you're following Brant, Matthew, and myself, and you're not subscribed to her channel, go hit the subscribe button right now. I know all of you aren't because I've seen the numbers. So go over. Hit the, it, it's right down there. Hit the subscribe button. More meals are coming from the bay. If you subscribe more, she'll feed me more. So let's let's get after that, guys. Maybe I won't eat cheese balls all the time. If I can have better meals like there this. There you go. Let's there you go. There you go. As always, guys, thanks for watching. If you like the video, don't forget, shoot me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. Let's chat in the comments.